Chosen ones, where you are, where you are, where you are, where you are, where you are. Chosen ones, back with another powerful and productive video, right? Great. Someone is interested in the same partner that you are with or you are dating right now. Yes, so many people are interested with the same partner that you are with all right great and maybe you've been wondering why it is happening like that why the opposite gender are proposing to your partner meanwhile they know that mm, this person is married to you or you are married to this person or you know you're going out with this person yet despite what is happening they still keep coming proposing love to your partner and you don't understand it you don't you just don't know why it is happening like that and sometimes you wonder when you weren't with that person it seems like nobody was going to them all right but the moment you start to be with them you know or get married to them it's like more people are coming or maybe it could be you watching this video right now and when nobody was with you you know People don't come that way. But when this particular person came into your life and has taken you serious or got married to you or proposed love to you, then other people, many people keep coming your way. I mean, proposing love to you. And sometimes you get confused, right? Great. I am here to answer your question for you. All right. Great. Um, so make sure you watch the entire video because this video is for you. You did not click on this video by accident. All right. The title made you click on it. It means there is something you want to hear. All right. So open up. You are going to hear whatever you want to. All right. You are going to get answers to your challenge, to your problem, to whatever situation you are facing in your relationship. Okay. Great. That's just by the way, chosen one. Forgive me. All right. It's like there is the, the, the Hamatan is, is, is severe here in Ghana, you know, and it's so much right oh my nose and my throat is even paining me but it is what it is it is part it is seasonal you know that tells us the impermanent of things right everything is not permanent all right um no situation lasts forever there is time and season for everything all right so this season two will pass all right great so that's just by the way um we will look at this topic I'll give three reasons. Three reasons why someone is interested in your partner or so many people are interested in the same partner you are interested in. The first reason I will say is that you are attractive. You are the attractive one. Why? You are the attractive one. That is the reason why, you know, people are trying to also propose to your partner. You see, when you are attractive one, you always leave room for people to be curious about who who you are who you are with all right great and because there is some sort of curiosity people like to be curious to find out what is it hey this person this um person with this charming personality prison personality is with this lady is with that gentleman what, what is it what could be the secret right so they they keep thinking they, they are like they don't understand why you choose that person as your partner all right so because of you they are wondering maybe there is something special about that person all right meanwhile you are the attractive one so you are making them curious through you they feel curious because you have the pleasing personality the charming personality you are the prize you are you know you are everything all right great so because of you the other person automatically become attractive yes that is why you realize that after a breakup if a breakup happened or that person pulled away from you that person becomes empty without you or nothing without you all right and it's like the people that were trying to go out with a person as the person was with you in a relationship 
all of such people will leave because of you leaving that person or that person breaking away from you or you breaking up with that person that is going to also drive the other people it is because of you that the other people are coming in because you are the prize you are the attractive one that is why i always say chosen one put the work on you put the work on you love yourself cherish yourself because you are very important you are a very important personality all right and people love you for who you are that is why it happens like that all right so that is the first reason why you may be with somebody and all of a sudden people will keep coming and people will keep proposing you know you know that mm, this your partner it's like now the competition is so hard it's like other people are coming in other people are showing interest and you, sometimes you don't feel uncomfortable right it is because you are an attractive person and you are automatically making the other person too attractive and that is the reason people are curious to find out what is it that you have seen in that person all right before you go in for such a person all right sometimes it could be the person you know that their family background they don't have anything they, they, they they're not rich they know you know um they're not rich they're not all that poor you know but you know you just love to be with the person so it gets people surprised it gets people astonished why this person you of all this caliber why choose this uh yes yeah, so it it makes people curious to find out so that is the reason why okay that is the number one reason the second reason is um you know you being the attractive the second reason is they are the attractive one it could be that they are the attractive one all right it could be they are putting in the work yeah it could be they are putting in the work as you know they are with you all right so as they work on themselves or it could be you okay working on yourself as you're working on yourself you become attractive all right and that, that draw people to you it makes people to gravitate towards you because you are taking yourself serious right because you are doing something that is purposeful because you are engaging in your potential and these are the things that makes one uh, purposeful that makes one productive that makes one attractive all right you stay in your purpose in your divine purpose right you having something to do each and every day all right you keep on persisting per uh, for bearing you know you keep on persevering you keep on being patient consistent you know trusting the process you know it makes you attractive people always look up to you a person of that caliber people are always going to look up to you all right because you doing something that not everybody is doing and that makes you attractive and that make people to gravitate towards you all right that draw people good people inform people inspire people all manner of people to you all right and that could be a reason why you know um people are trying to i mean follow up like you know interfere in your relationship to come propose to come you know to to show love to show some kind of likeness you know they also want to be with you they you know um like so many people are interested in you as you are in a relationship all right if that is happening these are the reasons all right great um the third reason i'll talk of okay um has to do with you being spiritual okay um not you being spiritual per se but it's a spiritual sort of thing okay it's a spiritual kind of thing um you see spiritually okay if you are with somebody and people realize that heaven is aware of that like spiritually the two of you are meant to be the person is your is really your kingdom spouse the person is really um your soulmate your twin flame or whatever all right people are going to try to interfere to cause confusion to try to destroy the relationship to try to make sure um you see your partner as somebody who is unfaithful all right somebody um who you know when you go ahead to be with the person you know you're not gonna be happy because there are so many people that will be coming in the relationship all right 
it is a trick of the devil it is a trick of the enemy all right to get you to 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 get separated yes you see the enemy the devil jesus christ said the devil sole assignment in our life is to steal to rob um to destroy all right and to even kill right that is the devil's agenda all right great so that is what the devil wants to achieve in your relationship that is why all of a sudden so many people will be gravitating will be trying to be proposing to your partner and stop be disturbing the relationship be this be disturbing your partner and sometimes your partner is going to be carried away by such things that your partner is gonna get confused your partner is gonna be like is it that i'm with, with the wrong person all right your partner is gonna be bluffing your partner is gonna be like uh, the slightest thing your partner is gonna I mean, flame up, there's going to be disputes, there's going to be misunderstanding and a whole lot of things in the relationship just because there are so many people in the line wanting him or her, all right? So the person feel like, yeah, there are so many people there. So if you you don't want to treat me well, you don't want to take me serious, if you don't want to give me my peace of mind, my peace of heart, the slightest thing, the person is going to take it serious and the person is going to act as if he's got, he or she is not going to communicate with you, he or she is ignoring you or something, all right? And the moment you create that room, the devil enters. And when the devil enters, boom, the devil begins to scatter and destroy because that is the agenda. That is what they want to achieve in that relationship to make sure the two of you, you go your separate ways. Meanwhile, divinely, God has connected you people together. But the enemy will try whatever possible means to make sure they send people your way. They send people that will act as lovers. They send people that will, will be at the gate that will be knocking. That will be knocking. That will be knocking. The moment you open in, they will enter. And every relationship is like that every relationship you know um when you are in a relationship more, it, more often it's like there are people that are always at the door knocking because they know for sure that one day one day there is going to be misunderstanding one day one day there is going to be a dispute because we are social beings so no matter what we cannot live in peace all the time for sure somebody is going to step on your toe there is going to be some misunderstanding there's going to be some quarrel the moment that happened you see these people you've opened the door the door has been opened for them so they will come in trying to console your partner trying to i mean be like friends you know and before you know boom they've gotten your partner maybe um you're gonna see what is going on and you say oh your partner is cheating on you you are cheating on me you are not faithful to me you are not loyal to me okay that is over that is over i don't want to see you again go go take your bag pack your things leave you know i'm seeking for divorce and, and so many things and it has happened to so many relationships they never knew that this is spiritual they refuse to consult god whether to leave the relationship or not to leave but because they've seen such a thing they've i mean yield to the secret deceptive evil agenda of the enemy to separate them and they allow themselves to be separated that is the reason why most people okay that god has connected them to their divine helpers their prospective wives and husband and other things are now divorced are today divorced and you realize that you've not find anybody quite like that person that you've left because of unfaithfulness or this very thing that i'm talking about it is spiritual i'm telling you it is spiritual and that is the goal the goal is to separate the two of you and you've allowed the enemy to achieve it in that is why most people when they are in a relationship with you they don't like friends to be trying to be intruding they don't like you to be make friends with the opposite gender and stuff because for sure human beings misunderstanding is gonna come quarrel is gonna come the moment that happens you see the other people as friends trying to console you before you know they put your back on the floor and boom that is gonna scatter your home that is gonna scatter your loving relationship right before you know you've committed a very big mistake you've been separated from your divine helper your divine person that is supposed to be with you all right so these are the reason why you may be in a relationship with someone you get married to someone and so many people 
trying to be interested in the same partner that you are with i believe this video has helped you in a way all right so my advice is whatever is happening okay realize that um you are the attractive one all right put in the work and always keep seeking god's guidance first let wisdom guide you in whatever that happens all right don't just take your will to say it is over look deeper look deep maybe this person you are with have been doing a lot for you is a good person but whatever happened whatever cheating whatever unfaithfulness that has happened is as a result of a mistake all right it's something it's a it's it's, it's a loophole that you've created the devil created for the devil and you allow the devil to interfere all right so you have, you need to analyze what happened what made them do what they did all right it could be your mistake it could be something you need to i mean find remedy to raise something you need to i mean sit up with them talk it over with them you didn't you flame up you get angry you you, you push them off you and that has led to such a thing all right and you know that's it so always make sure you let wisdom guide you in whatever decision that you take it don't take decisions when you are angry when you are emotionally up you know the moment you are angry you are off your low vibration i'm telling you and if you don't take care whatever decision that you're gonna take you you you're gonna later realize that hmm it has been a silly mistake on your path or something all right so always don't make decision when you are angry okay take your time breathe in relax when you are relaxed you are poised you are serene you are peaceful that is when you make the right decision all right great so that is what you got to do to help you in your relationship all right great so always to keep working on yourself know that the love that will sustain you on this earth is the love you give to yourself and not the love of any other person a man or a woman or something but the love you really love yourself and the love you really have for god that is the love that will sustain you remember to remember again that whatever you are not born with can leave you at any point in time including whoever comes your way including whatever property you've achieved including whatever you've achieved on this earth being it cars being it mansions being it businesses being a children being it wife being it husband being it whatever all right so always remember that and make sure you don't attach yourself to the things you've accumulated or achieved here on earth all right always get more closer to your god because god will always be there for you all right and be in your purpose your potentials that is what makes you attractive that will never leave you because it's something that is within you it's your god-given gift right great thank you so much see you in my next video i'm out for now peace